today across the country and the satellite picture indicates convective clouds over parts of Gulf of Guinea states which will cause rain and thunderstorm in the affected area and also over southern Mauritania dust haste will persist in the next 24 hours. For the forecast tonight we'll be expecting a warm and hazy atmosphere to prevail over the entire country whilst tomorrow We'll be expecting a hazy and partly cloudy conditions to prevail over the entire country with mild conditions over the coastal areas and very warm over the inland areas. Winds will vary between westerlies and southwesterlies in orientation, which will be about 15 to 20 kilometers per hour. Morning temperatures over the west will vary between 22 and 24 degrees Celsius, whilst over the rest of the country, they will vary between 26 and 27 degrees Celsius. For the afternoon temperatures, over the west, it will vary between 31 and 39 degrees Celsius, whilst over the rest of the country, it will vary between 37 and 40 degrees Celsius. For the low tide, we will be expecting 0.5 meters at 8.24 a.m. and 0.4 meters at 9.22 p.m. For the high tide, we will be expecting 1.5 meters at 2.50 a.m. and 1.7 meters at 3.09 p.m. For the wave height, we will vary between 1 to 2 meters high, slight to moderate southeastern swells. The sun will rise at 6.34 and will set at 19.30. Thanks for watching and do have a wonderful evening. From the weather report, we take a quick look at our headlines before we end this edition of the news. The Minister of Health and Social Welfare, Balagaba Jahumpa, has expressed concern over the alarming rate of smoking in the country in a televised statement on the eve of World No Tobacco Day. Actors in disaster management have been meeting to map out strategies and strengthen synergies, synergies rather, on disaster risk reduction. Controversy in Senegal as the majority leader in the country's National Assembly called for the reintroduction of the death penalty nearly a decade since its ab abolition and the Pakistani Taliban has a new number two. This as an American drone strike kills Deputy Commander Wari Ur Rahman in Pakistan's border with Afghanistan. Well that's all in this edition of the news. Thank you for watching. Join us at 10 for another bulletin. Meanwhile enjoy our programs. starts with the Nescafe. Nestle, good food, good life. Programme Borella, Willem de Isil, Alhamis Kunekasi.